Alright everyone, welcome back to my channel Code with Hafiz. My name is Hafizullah Masudi and in this video I'm going to show you how you can separate the redirection after logging in using Fortify authentication because you might want to separate the login for the admin and other types of users according to your need. So in this video I will show you how you can do that. Well for this tutorial we will only uh, separate the login redirection for admin and user so let's start guys well before everything make sure you have implemented the logic for your user type separation because you must separate your users uh, using their type for example the system should be able to know which user is a admin or which user is a simple user or uh, which user is for example director or etc so you have to write the logic for it well, you can write it uh, on your own or you can use packages something like Lara Trust or Spati or etc. So in this project we haven't built that. So let's first uh, separate the users according to their type. So let's go to the database, localhost and phpMyAdmin. And in here, let's go to the Laravel 8 op and let's go to users and structure. And in here, what I will do is after the let's say name, we want to put a field, and I want to name this field let's say type. And for the type, let's say watcher, and for the length 191, and let's say save. Now let's go to the browse because we want to declare the type for these two users. Well, let's say Hafiz is admin and this user account is, let's say, a simple user. Now we want to separate the redirection after login uh, for both of these accounts and we want to redirect them uh, to a different blade. So let's open the project in the text editor and what we can do is in here let's go to our route file well i want to mention one thing that i have built the fortify authentication system already and you can check it out in my previous videos of this playlist so if you don't know how to implement uh, the authentication system in laravel 8 using fortify so please go to the previous videos and see it how you can do that so let's go to the web.php well, let me zoom it a little bit for you to see better okay now we want to separate the view after we log in as you can see after we log in we have declared this slash home url or route and it uh, checks for the middleware auth so now what we want to do is at the top let's say we want to use auth and inside this route what I will do is cut this return so let's cut it and let's put an if statement and inside if statement let's check for auth colon colon check we want to check the user if it's logged in and inside this if statement we want to put another if statement and this time we want to check for auth colon colon let's say user parenthesis arrow type if the type is equal to admin then let's say we want to return or redirect the user to the home blade and after that let's say else else we want to return the user to another blade so for example let's say this blade should be user now let's create this user blade in our views folder so let's go to resources views and let's right click new file and let's say user.blade.php press enter well we can copy everything from the home blade so let's copy it from here let's say control a and copy everything and paste it here well for the code we don't need this table so let's remove it 
and in here let's say this is users dashboard and at the top well we don't need this model also so let's remove it and for the header let's remove this button and in here let's say user dashboard save the file now let's uh, get back to the browser and check our code if it works so let's go to the browser i already have opened the project in the uh, browser tab so let's go to login first of all let's login as admin so the account was hafiz at app.com and the password is password press enter you can see guys it redirected us to the home blade which we declared for the admin uh, user type so now let's try to log in with the other other user account so let's log out and now let's say login and this time let's say user at app.com password is password and press enter you can see guys it redirected us to the user dashboard so guys this was how to separate the redirection after logging in into the system in laravel 8 and uh, for the authentication system i already have told you that we have used fortify so if you are using fortify you should be good to go i think this is enough for this video so thanks for watching and don't forget to like the video and also share it with your friends and if you are new to this channel please subscribe to my channel for support all right guys thanks for watching and see you guys in the next video